This is the 20 craziest custom vehicles in LEGO Fortnite. Starting with a build that is so good it may as well be an official collab. Because the Mad Puck has somehow managed to recreate the Razor Crest from the Mandalorian. I don't think I'm exaggerating when I say this is one of the most beautiful things that I've ever seen in LEGO Fortnite. I'm feeling pretty confident when I say that if Epic Games give us the ability to build official collab vehicles in Fortnite, they could release this and it wouldn't look as good. And you're probably sat there thinking, well that's all well and good, but it doesn't even fly. And I'm very, very happy to tell you, you're wrong. A fully working, flying Razor Crest in LEGO Fortnite. It's official, the Mad Puck is an absolute legend. But the Star Wars universe extends even further with people's custom builds, because Long Tom has managed to create an actual X-Wing. The details on this thing are absolutely insane, there's even a tiny burger on top which is supposed to represent R2-D2. Truthfully, I'm just jealous that I'm never going to be able to build anything as impressive as this. If you're not a fan of flying, don't worry though, because some LEGO Fortnite players like to keep things a little bit more grounded. And that statement definitely applies to the Full Effect, who has managed to create a working tank. We of course got these in Battle Royale way back in the Resistance season, but I'm definitely going to throw it out there, this is far better than Epic's version. I'm being totally truthful with you, if this guy approaches me asking me to join his army, I think I can only say yes. I reckon we should probably take things back to the sky again. But there's bound to be LEGO Fortnite players out there who are looking for something a little bit more personalised. Well this absolute genius on Reddit has got your back with his custom jetpack. Being able to travel across my survival world in style like this would probably mean I never want to land again. And we may have had jetpacks in Battle Royale before, but they don't even come close to how amazing this thing looks. If that's a little bit small for you though, why not take a look at Twilight Sapphire's fully working Zeppelin. Ladies and gentlemen, we may just have found the winner for biggest custom vehicle in LEGO Fortnite history. This thing is so big and so incredible, you're essentially transporting an entire village across your map every time you use it. All I can say is round of applause Twilight Sapphire, you've pretty much taken my breath away. I know what you're thinking, you're probably saying, well that just seems a little bit serious to me, why don't we take things in a more relaxed direction? Say hello to the modernist on YouTube and their fully working ice cream truck. Not only were they able to drive this around their world, it even had the capability to make ice creams inside. It's amazing, it's incredible, this is all well and good, but all this has done is really make me want an ice cream and now I'm annoyed. And what better way to solve that than returning to the world of Star Wars? Because the ridiculously talented Michael Not Mike has somehow managed to create a working TIE fighter. As you can see, it flies like an absolute dream. It's so good, in fact, it's genuinely making me think about switching to the dark side. All that space travel has left me feeling a little bit sick, though let's bring things back down to Earth. How about a pretty juicy looking semi truck created by JJ and Juan? Truthfully, I'd never really thought about a career as a trucker up to this point, but I think I'm starting to change my mind. That version may not necessarily be drivable, but external ads definitely is. This dude just took off the trailer and started ploughing across his survival world and it looks beautiful. A round of applause for you my dude, you're an absolute champion. If you're carrying goods all over the place in the back of a semi-truck, once you get it to the other end, you're going to need something to lift it. How about a legitimate forklift created by Sono Boro? I'm so sorry if I've absolutely butchered your name there, I was just too busy staring at this incredible creation. And I'm pretty confident you're thinking the same as I was when I first saw this. How are you going to pick anything up if the forklift doesn't properly work? Well, luckily for you, it absolutely does. The lift actually goes up and down. I'm totally baffled as to how people manage to make these things. But if water's more your thing, let's take a look at the full effect hovercraft. This isn't just some run-of-the-mill boat that travels on water, okay? It can do land as well. Not only that, but it's absolutely huge. Imagine the storage capabilities on this thing. If you're looking for a little bit more of a relaxed chill-out time, check out the sailboat by Gluten Cakes. Lazy days on the lake in your own personalised sailboat. What could be more chilled out than that? Not only am I hugely impressed, I'm also massively jealous. But things get even better as we make a return to the sky with this custom plane made by Moonseeker. I don't know about you, but I'm getting some pretty heavy World War II bomber vibes from this. I'm just there working with basic ass platforms and a thruster, whilst we've got talented people out here like Moonseeker making incredible creations. And that just makes me feel bad. I'm definitely feeling better now that I'm taking a look at Legion of Shadows helicopter though. 
Traveling across the desert biome just became a hell of a lot easier using this thing. Well, that would be the case if I was talented enough to build something like this, but I guess I'll just have to keep watching Legion of Shadow instead. For all of you petrol heads out there though, let's take a look at a muscle car created by Orion Trial. That right there is a pretty juicy looking beast. It's so powerful, in fact, it doesn't just drive, it also flies. I mean, why just settle for the roads when you're as good as this? You may as well take things into the sky as well. If you fail to get your vehicle into the air though, why not just copy I Hardly Try Hard and just start climbing walls? Even gravity is not enough to stop this amazing vehicle. This thing is so powerful, you don't even have to stay in the driver's seat. You could just get out and stand on top. If this is what I Hardly Try Hard is creating when they're putting in no effort, I'd love to see them at 100%. There is a chance though that in 2024 you might be a little bit more environment conscious and so you're looking to take some public transport. Well, Roe Maleficent has got that sorted for you because they have created a monorail. I'm definitely down for this. Sometimes after a hard day's work on your survival world gathering resources, you just can't be bothered to drive. Don't panic, just relax, put your feet up and get across the desert biome in seconds apparently because this thing is seriously quick. But the amazing creations don't stop there because I'm about to show you something that looks like it's come straight out of a sci-fi movie. This is a pod racer airship created by They Call Me Cozy and I'm literally blown away by this thing. Not only does it look incredible, fly absolutely amazingly, it's even got a ton of storage too. What more could you ask for? Well, I suppose some custom lighting from the bright bedroom set. Oh, no, they've got that covered as well. Fair play. Let's take things to the next level though with a vehicle that Jins is calling the Survival Utility Aircraft. I mean, they couldn't be more right if they tried. It's got everything you could ever need. It looks incredible, flies absolutely amazingly, and the storage capacity for this thing is off the charts. And if you're thinking you're gonna be flying around stuck without your machinery, don't panic, because it's even got a metal smelter and a crafting bench. And if you're panicking that you're gonna be absolutely exhausted with all of this hard work and you're not gonna have anywhere to sleep, obviously it's got a bed, what were you thinking? All of that in one vehicle. This person should be winning awards. It's not only aircrafts that are hitting the skies though, because apparently boats are as well. Shout out to Leviathan for this one. I mean, you really are a genius. It could just be me, but watching this thing sail through the skies is really reminding me of that ridiculous scene from the Uncharted movie. The only difference is Tom Holland wishes he could fly in something as good as this. But if that creation wasn't quite big enough for you, Jins is back once again with the biggest pirate ship you've ever seen. Okay, yes, technically we can't really call this a vehicle because it can't necessarily get moving, but when it looks as good as this, who even cares? Captain Jack Sparrow wouldn't even know what to say if he saw this thing because it's putting the Black Pearl to shame. It's got private rooms, places to sleep, a bathroom, even storage, what more could you want? How about a crow's nest right at the top of the ship where you can look out across your survival world? Well, yeah, obviously it's got that as well. One day, I hope to be able to build something as incredible as this. And so there you have it, people. That was the 20 craziest custom vehicles in LEGO Fortnite. A huge shout out and massive thank you to every single person who've had their creations featured in this video. Make sure that you go down below to the description and take a look at their incredible creations in their full glory. Because without people as talented as these guys, videos like this would literally be impossible. And that is pretty much everything that I've got for you guys today here in this video. Let me know down below in the comment section if you'd like to see a part two and peace out.